Good morning and welcome. This is vlog number five for me. Um, I've put together a few now. This one's about Jenny Dixon Beach. Jenny Dixon Beach is about five, ten k's up the coast from here. I headed out the other morning. This was one of several attempts I've had to try and shoot Jenny Dixon Beach. Every time the tide's been wrong or someone else has beaten me to the punch, been there taking photos before me. So this was uh, probably the second time I've been there taking photos. I took some earlier in the year. In the following vlog I'll put up some photos that I took this time and then some other photos at the end that I took earlier last year. Hope you enjoy it. Welcome to uh, Jenny Dixon Beach. It's about quarter past five in the morning. I'm up here early this morning. I've uh, been checking the tides and this morning we should get a, um, a low tide. And I've come up here this morning to try and shoot a sunrise. And um, there's a really unusual rock platform here at Jenny Dixon that I'm gonna try to capture as the tide runs out. Uh, hopefully with a the uh, sunrise in the background so I'll just get set up and um, just wait for the sun to come up a little bit further. The sun's just starting to come up a little bit more. I've got my camera set up out the front here trying to capture a little bit of foreground interest with these rocks and what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to wait until the water actually runs away and exposes the rocks like they are there now and then try and fire the shot there um, the tide's just a fraction high at the moment, but that's not a problem because um, the sun won't be up for about another 20 minutes and I'm going to try and capture it as the sun comes across the horizon. But this is Jenny Dixon Beach. It was actually wrongly named Jenny Dixon. It was actually named after a coal schooner that ran aground out of here, which was a shipwreck in about 1871. And the coal schooner was called Janet Dixon. All the survivors made their way up onto the shore here and then over the years the name's been uh, modified and changed slightly through, I guess, through um, hearsay and, and the name's actually Jenny Dixon now where the actual coal skinner was called Janet Dixon but yeah, a lot of area interest in the area, the old lighthouse out on the horizon out there, a lot of shipwrecks around this area, a lot of rocks which make it really good for foreground interest. I'm just going to run you through my, um, my settings. I've got a 1.6 second shutter speed on F8 at ISO 100. I'm using the Nikon D7100. On the front I've got a Takina 11 to 16 wide angle lens. And on the front I've got the Firecrest Polarizer just to give me a little bit more detail in the horizon and in the cloud. So we'll fire off a couple of shots, see how we go, but yeah, the morning's definitely starting to improve. Sun's coming up now and these rocks are really starting to become exposed as you can see in front of me. And we've just got the sun just touching on the horizon. I've actually gone for a big stopper, I'm trying to smooth the ocean out. So I've got a 10 stopper on there. Uh, my shutter speed will probably be around uh, one, min one minute 20 seconds. Um, so I'm just cresting the horizon now.
with this image this morning, I've actually chosen to try and accentuate the foreground. The sky's not too bad this morning. There's a little bit of colour happening, but um, just be because there's more interest with this, um, I guess you would call it a tessellated rock platform out in front, I'm trying to capture that more in the image. But I'm um, starting to really get a lot of beautiful colour into the sky now, so really glad I came up here this morning. The only one drawback in the whole sting is the uh, coal ships that are out on the horizon. But I might even take them out later on. What I'll do is I'll put up two shots. I'll put one with the coal ship in the background, one without. You guys tell me what you think. It's not unusual though. We'd have coal ships. We've got the largest coal terminal about 25 kilometres up the coast, largest coal terminal in the world, so um, yeah, quite a few of them off the coast here. Have a look at this one. Just firing off the last couple of shots here, what's been a great morning. Um, the rocks are really exposed now, the sun's well and truly up. I've just fired a shot off here at um, 30 seconds, uh, 100 ISO. Um, but yeah, really lovely morning as you can see. Rocks are really well exposed here now. And um, yeah, it's just a great morning. it from Jenny Dixon Beach. For those of you who enjoyed the content of this video please give it a thumbs up down below or if you haven't been to my channel before and you'd like to please subscribe. Tap the notification bell down below so you'll be notified when I upload my next video. For all of those who have already have sub subscribed and especially since the last lot of videos I put up, thank you. I really appreciate it. I appreciate your feedback. Leave a comment or a question below. I always try and answer if I can. Hopefully I'll be uploading another video shortly, so I'll see you next time.